For people living in some parts of the southern Arizona desert, the sight of piles of trash is becoming a new normal. Though it's unclear who's leaving all the garbage behind, they say trash dumping in the desert is an ongoing problem. 13 News reporter Raya Torres spoke to some of these residents today. And Raya, how are they reacting to the problem? Neighbors tell me they're frustrated. People love the open landscape of the southern Arizona desert for the view or walks, but when the only sight they're seeing is trash, it starts to ruin the appeal. It's been this way for a few years, but it recently it's been starting to get a little worse. In the midst of the Arizona wilderness, random pieces of trash invade the landscape. For frequent visitors, seeing the unnatural items causes a lot of frustration. Clint, a nearby resident, says this upsets him a lot. Yeah, I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. My kids don't like to see it. My friends and neighbors that come out here, we, we just really dislike it a lot. It's disheartening, I guess is the best word to say. Clint has admired the beauty of this desert for close to 40 years, but more often than not, when he's out with his kids, he'll come across scenes like this, where trash is sprawled throughout parts of the desert. One of the latest sightings is from a bathroom remodel, a worn down bathtub on its side with remnants of drywall and boxes around it. Clint found an address on one of the disposed boxes. He and his friend went out to the home and informed the homeowners of the trash from the remodel left in the desert. He says the homeowners seemed to be unaware of the problem. The next day, the trash was gone. No harm, no foul, but they got caught. Had they not, then it would still be sitting out there. Something similar happened to Connie Coons about 10 years ago. She hired someone to take her trash out to the dump, but it didn't make it there. I got a letter in the mail probably a couple weeks later, and it was a picture of my garbage, like in somebody's alley. The city explained to her over the phone that the trash was cleaned up, but she was already embarrassed. Connie tried calling the person she hired, but she couldn't reach them. And more than 10 years since her incident, trash dumping in the desert continues to be an ongoing issue. It's sad. It's sad that we of a society are still thinking that that's acceptable. Not the, the vast majority, but obviously there is, you know, people that don't have a problem with dumping garbage in the desert. Both Connie and Clint hope that by getting the word out, this can be a source of education and reflection. They hope people think twice before inappropriately disposing of their garbage. Reporting in studio, Raya Torres, 13 News.